Okay, this is a side-by-side -side comparison of the 2012 model and the 2009 model HDR units. And you can see some differences. This one has a black witness well. This one has a gray witness well. Um, this one has silver knobs. This one has black knobs. Um, here's another one. Uh, the 2009 had a simple uh, plug. This one has a more of a heavy duty plug. See? It also has a thicker wire, heavier gauge than the other one. I mean, it's just, you know, a lot of the changes are, are not that major. But, you know, there they are. And, you know, I'm going to test it out now. And let's see what, what effects we have with both units. I'm going to plug them both in now. Okay, this is the watch experiment. First, I'm going to do it with the 2012 HDR. See? It's moving. And uh, then I'm going to do it with the 2009. See? There you go. Now, let's put it with the 2009 HDR. It's, I think, going the same speed. So, it doesn't appear to generate a more powerful time field with one than with the other. And you can take a look. See what you think. They both appear to be about the same. So that's it, basically. I mean, they, both units appear to work very similar, and they're not all that different. And I'm planning to open them up later on and see what differences there are on the insides of both units. But basically, you're taking a look at the comparison between uh, the 2012 model, which is brand new, and the old... Uh, 2009 model. That's basically it.